a special occasion today. It is your girl, RG3. And today is a special occasion. Today we have two giants colliding. The Royalty Black Panther versus OG8169 Soft. This is a battle of the softies. Shout out to the Waivers Club. If you like how this t-shirt look to you, click the link in the description to purchase the Waivers Club tee. When you walk into the store, you got the OG. If you can find one, cause we know they're rare, this is what you get. This is this is what the brush comes in. Uh, if you catch it in the store, um, 8169. It's going up against the royalty. The royalty. Initially, if we were buying off of, of excitement, off the look of how something looks when you see it first, the first impression. If we're going on first impression, you would look at these two and say what? Man, I'm gonna grab that joint in the box, fam. Like, who uses twisty ties? You feel me? Let me get that joint in the box. That box look fire, right? Okay, just so you guys know, these two brushes are the very, the same exact brush, but this paint comes off of the um, original Diane's. They come off when you put miles on them, when you're working with them, they come off. So I just wanted you guys to know this is the same brush. Now, this is the Royalty. Also, this, this paint on the Royalties do not come off uh, that easily. Some people like to put a coat of clear coat over it or some tape, but they don't, the labels don't come off of these as easily as the uh, 8169 does, which is a plus. Back to back, you can't really tell them apart. These these back parts, some people like to use them for grip. These are deeper on the royalty version. The paint jobs are pretty much competitive. The uh, royalty has a slightly higher gloss shine on the paint. The length is pretty competitive, uh, but if you can see with your close eye, the royalty has more length and depth on the bristles, meaning deeper bristles, deeper reach, deeper waves, okay? As far as bristle quality, um, when we speaking about boar bristle, pure boar bristle, we like to see that dark bristle. I don't know if you can see them with the boar is a, is a, is a complicated bristle. So um, it's deeper than it is the OG8169. Bristle quality is pretty much overall better on the royalty brush than it is on the a169 the royalty is an eight row brush meaning eight rows of bristles okay one two three four five six seven eight eight and the a169 is seven one two three four five six seven so what does eight rows versus seven eight, rows eight, mean so more coverage okay more is better, right? Okay, so more coverage for the royalty, better quality bristles, longer, deeper bristles, and more exciting packaging, right? Okay, so the question y'all wanna ask now is how do they perform against each other? So as far as performance, I wanna take y'all back a step. Brush King's brushes are the quality overall. There's been nothing like it in the game until Brush King brought the high quality brushes to us. For instance, look at this 8169. This 8169 um, is uh, <laughs> the bootleg version they came out with not too long ago. This is what people are buying. This is the new school, not an OG. And as you can see, it's pretty sad. Um, it's smaller, the bristles are shorter. And I use this for fresh cuts, you know, to brush to dry the dead hair out. Man, I can't stand this brush. But I had to bring it up to show y'all. You're not gonna get your hands on a new a, uh, OG A169, not easily. If you think you're about to come close to this brush in quality, this is what they got in the store right now that you're gonna get. It's a smaller brush. It's way mad cheap. And uh, you're gonna be extremely dissatisfied with this joint. Uh, so yeah, 
the availability. It's available right now. If you was in love with the A169 OG, this boy is available right now. There's no need to wait. So the accessibility is another thing that's winning. So been out, no rag, all morning. So I'm a little fuzzy. And we are gonna take these bad puppies for a spin. So when you're brushing with a softy, the main things that you want out your soft brush is to polish, shine, smooth out the waves, and lay them down. You do not want a softy. You do not. You do not. You do not want a softy that disturbs your pattern. Okay, you want it to lay it down smooth so you can throw your do rag on, right? So I've had maybe three sessions with this brush since I got it, and the most impressive thing is the pull. It is a soft brush that has pull. Now, a lot of people are gonna say, but RG3, the OG A169 had pull. Yeah, that's true. The OG A169 has a different lay. You don't have to apply much pressure at all to get this brush to lay down your hair. The best way to soft brush The best way to soft brush is just to lay the brush on top of your hair and let the brush do the work. Laying it down already. It's less work. Less work with this one. Most of my uh, 789 rolls, I like to vertical brush with, and we're gonna check the performance. So the A169 pretty much passed the vertical brush. Um, let's see what the Royalty 801 is gonna do on the vertical brush. I feel like the 801 adds more depth for it to be a softy plus. The longer bristles give more depth in the wave. So, so far my favorite, not being biased, is the 801 uh, for the simple fact of, look how it's doing on my thin hairs. Performing good on the thin hairs. Both brushes are pretty good. This by far has been one of the hardest brush reviews I've been, I've had to do. So in order to really break the tie, it's not a tie because like I said, the presentation, the delivery, the first impression from the box on to the bristle quality of the Royalty 801 is unmatched. But to test the true quality of this brush, I'm going to add a product. I'm gonna add an oil in, some castor oil, okay? And we're gonna brush that in. I'm gonna brush half, half of my head with the Royalty 801 and the other half with the 8169. Then you'll be the judge, all right? So this test is how, how well does each brush distribute product? That's the ultimate test. Bam. Now let's put these brushes to the test. I'm gonna brush my right side with the Royalty. No, I'm gonna brush my right side with the OG A169. Let's get it. So 
we're gonna move on to that royalty L1 on the left side. Another brush review. Those 